Cheryl Golden, her daughter, is being um, treated in the infirmary at the Forsyth County Jail after an incident on, inter on Business 40 on Wednesday morning. Um, Ms. Golden, can you tell us exactly what happened? Um, I got a phone call at 10.30 Thursday morning that my daughter was at the uh, Baptist Hospital being treated for some injuries. And I got to the hospital and just found out that my daughter was just about, she was just disfigured pretty bad. And I asked questions on what happened. And then there were uh, people that saw, there was in the back of the police car that saw what happened. To my understanding, the car door of the unmarked vehicle was open and then a body flew out, which was my daughter. They roughed her up a little bit and threw her back in the police car to take her to the hospital. And when you say police car, you mean a sheriff's vehicle? The sheriff's, sheriff's vehicle, yeah. Okay. And that's about pretty much, I don't know. It's just, I'm just baffled because, I mean, I'm not getting. I don't know. Okay. Can you describe your daughter injuries if you can? I can't describe them injuries. If you see her picture, then you'll know. Her whole body is disfigured. Her face, we're talking about a beautiful young lady. Mm -hmm. Now she's scarred for life. Oh, I want justice for Yolanda. I also want her out of that filthy infirmary that they call a hospital. And I want her placed in a facility at Baptist where she could be well taken care of. Because okay. at this point, she's not.